delicious vibes from the KWOD studio. If you follow my blog, you know that I am all about, like, weird metaphysical news items. This doesn't only happen in the physical realm, people. It happens in the realm beyond the veil. So this race you mentioned, when's it happening? Hop in, I'll tell you. Drive to this location. We have to meet Racer Girl. Who's Racer Girl? She's Racer Girl. Oh, gotcha. So, Muscle, what made you decide not to take a dive like Frank wanted you to? Nothing. Holston went down too easy. Hell, I wouldn't be surprised if someone paid him to take a dive. Huh. So, why stick around if Frank is out for your head? I, why not just leave Vegas? Go somewhere nice, like Reno. You don't run from a guy like Frank. Go to Bermuda, there's a cabana boy packing a submachine gun with your name on it. And besides, fuck him. Now you're talking. F him in the A. Racer girl! How are you, my darling? I'd be better if I had some of your bitches, Brew. A new batch will be ready tomorrow, my sweet. That's what I like to hear. Who's your friend? Jason, meet Racer Girl. Racer Girl, Jason, a new driver. Sweet. Hope you can keep up. You driving too, E? No, just along for the ride. Then hop in. Show's about to start. like you could really handle some dangerous curves. <laughs> I can handle anything you throw at me. Good to know. There's always other races going on in Vegas, you know. If you find yourself strapped for cash, hit one up. Yeah, I might do that. See you around. It's Karen. You free? You made it! Nice! I need some backup, and my usual go-to is out of town. Yeah, it's good to see you too! Come on, we're going to Dunnerlin. What's in Dunnerlin? 
A good old-fashioned arms deal. Just need to grab a little something-something to help protect what little Vera has left. So, what's your deal? My deal? Yeah, like, what's your story? Once upon a time, there was a girl who didn't really feel like playing the getting-to-know-you game. That's my story. Ha! <laughs> playing hard to get, okay. I see how it's gonna be. Yeah, just drive, Southie. I lied to you last night. About my brothers. We didn't shoot at rats. We ran with like a... like a crew, I guess. But I got out. Stuck to fighting instead. Good to know. Seven, eight, making it leave. You're in Poppy's playground now. Only the hottest guns make the cut. Eighty-seven, eight. Stop up here. Luis, what goodies have you got for me today? Sorry, Karen. My hands are tied here. Ah, seriously? Take him out! Jason, grab cover! What the hell was that? Frank must have gotten to Luis and applied some pressure. Fuckers getting aggro on us all of a sudden. Cause of me? Probably. <sighs> At least Luis left the guns. Gotta take these to a safe house. Then I need to meet with Vera, figure out a plan. Hope I'm not gonna regret pulling you out of that car, Jason. Jason, we got a chat. Come meet me. Drive around while we talk. Okay, so we all got a Frank problem. Maybe we should skip the talking and get to the part where we take action. Action? No, no. I'm gonna arrange a sit-down. We'll hash out some things, I'm gonna vouch for you, and then things will go back to normal. And what's normal? You stay out of his way until he gets tired of playing by the rules? Again? 
until he takes control of this entire city and leaves you with nothing? Is that the Vegas you want? Frank tried to ruin the one good thing I had going for me. My fight. I thought he could walk right in and just take. I've known guys like Frank my whole life. Back in Boston, there was a jerk-off just like him who thought loyalty was a one-way street. Sure, he'll play nice while it's in his interest, but the next thing you know, your brother's dead. You're buying a one-way ticket to Las Vegas just to keep your fingers. I'm done taking shit from the Franks of the world. It's time for Frank Valiano to start playing by our rules. Easier said than done, kid. Frank's got friends, like Winston Goodman. And that's where we start. It's your man, Heavy Ben, on the hood. Let's take a call. You on the air. Must have heard. This is your cardiologist, Dr. Victor. Dr. Rick, hell yeah. You like hip hop? What's your favorite jam? Yeah, I find this music offensive and cruel. Your mother would be ashamed. You don't know what my mom... To the rest of this country, it's known as the city of sin. But to me, it's home. I'm Reverend and I'm here to tell you that together... That's right, burn, baby! I'm Reverend Winston Good. And I'm here to tell you Erase that together... everyone out celebrating Karen called and said it was a rousing success feels good doesn't it I hope we didn't just start a war I hope we did hello Jason hey I'm a friend of Karen well, I don't know, friend is such a passe term. It's more like we were in kindergarten together and I've been kind of oddly obsessed with her ever since. And she's been nice enough to indulge my obsessions by hanging out with me from time to time. Yeah. Uh, okay. Ronnie Q, by the way. Like the DJ girl? Exactly like the DJ girl. So, hey, uh, Karen says you're good at causing a little mayhem. True story, I like causing a little mayhem myself from time to time. You ever want to get into a little trouble together, come see, okay? Yeah. Sure. Karen say anything else about me? Who's Karen? Oh, right. <laughs> no, not really. Anyway, gotta go. Uh, come see me. Let's break stuff. Talking about an actual chariot or like a car. You never know in Vegas. I am, in fact, referring to a luxury automobile. For Frank, being delivered today in the industrial district, 
which you're going to go steal and deliver to an acquaintance of ours as a way of saying, Dear Mr. Belliano, the days of you having nice things will soon be over. Sincerely, fuck you. Any questions? Nope, just tell me where to go. Young Squire, bravo, bravo! This'll make a nice addition to my collection. Well, hopefully it'll send a message that we don't intend to... Hey, where are you going? Taking my new pet for a joyride. Toodaloo, boys! Keep fighting the good fight. So, I guess we just walk? Yep, 
It's fucking hard being a stone cold pimp. Am I right? Uh. BT Dubs, Muscle. If you ever need some extra cash, you can snag a car and bring it to this or any one of Carl's fine choppity choppity establishments. Nice. Good to know.